In this tutorial, we are going to be discussing how to use the studio to host a broadcast. We already have an episode scheduled and already are connected to the studio. The first thing you will notice is the on air button at the top left of this page. This lets you know how much time is left until the start of the show, as well as the time left while you are hosting the show. To the right of this section, you will see the invite a guest or co-host option. You can click on this and invite up to five guests or co-hosts using their email address. It will send them an invite to their email to use Direct Connect. To the right of this section, you will see different phone numbers for calling in. Here's the guest call in number, which is the number to give guests and listeners to call into the show the host call-in number, and the host PIN number. This is how the host is going to connect to the show. There is also an eye icon that, if selected, will show you some account in and show information. It shows the host call-in number, the host PIN number, the host ID number, and the episode ID number. Next, on the left side of the page, you will see the switchboard options. The telephone icon lets you call out to a guest that's located in the continental U.S. You can choose just to call out to them or to place them in the screening room, which is a private off-the-air room. Now we're going to be in the caller section. The host will be listed at the top of the page and the callers will be listed below that. You will notice that there are four buttons next to the caller's phone number. The first is to bring them live and on the air. The second is to mute them during the show. Please note that the callers are automatically muted when calling into the guest call-in number. The third option is the screen caller button. To use this feature, you want to first click on your Hosts screen button and then the caller screen button. This will put you in a private off the air room where you can talk to the caller. You can enter any caller information by clicking underneath their phone number and then save the changes. Once you are done screening the caller, you can either mute them or bring them live with you. The fourth button is the hang up button. This will disconnect the caller from the broadcast. Next, we are going to select the episode info section in the middle of the studio. This will show you episode information such as the title, the description, the date, time, and duration. You can click on the title or description to make any changes. You can also click on the actual duration to extend the time of the show. There are two other tabs in this section. The Promote tab that you will use to promote the show to Facebook and Twitter. The other tab is the chat tab. This will open up the chat room on the episode page to chat with listeners. You can, op you can launch the chat here, launch the chat as a co-host, or open the chat in a new window. The final section we will visit on the studio is the audio clip section. This is the area where you can upload and play audio clips. To upload an audio clip, you will want to click on the cloud arrow and it will then let you select a file from the computer as well as give it a description. And then you'll want to select upload. Files must be under 100 megabytes and in MP3, WMA, or WAV format. 
You can play a file by clicking on the play button next to the file name. You can also click on the pause button. Please note this is not a pause button, it will actually stop the file. If you try playing the file again, it will start over at the beginning. While the file is playing or before you play a file, you can adjust the volume of the file. Please note that this is an abrupt change and not a gradual change in sound. There is also a magnifying gl glass at the top of this section where you can search for specific files. Once you are done with your episode, you can press the End Episode button at the top of the page. This will end the episode and thank you for using Blog Talk Radio. Once the episode Goodbye. is ended, you will not be able to call back in. Thank you for watching.